Now to another round of snow hitting the west on top of the 10 feet that's already fallen in some areas. Faith Abubi is in Truckee, California. Good morning, Faith. Good morning to you, George. This homeowner here telling me he's about ready for a break in the wintry weather so this community can finally finish digging out. He says he's cleaned this vehicle twice in the last four days, but take a look at how much snow is still packed on top. This community is used to snow, but it's gotten to the point where they're concerned about the structural integrity of their rooftops. And here's why. There's so much snow from the ground all the way to the top of the house here, covering all the windows. There are several feet of snow also on top of the roof going all the way up to the chimney there. Here in the Sierra Nevada mountains, we've gotten more than 10 feet of snow since Friday in some parts. Wind gusts upwards of 190 miles per hour. Crews have been out on the roads, especially on the interstates, the highways, the main roads, clearing all of them. Interstate 80 opening for the first time since Friday, but there are still problem areas on the surface streets, the community roads that are still dicey to travel on. But officials are warning people once they're out and about, they should be cautious because we're expecting more snow as the system moves through. Robin. Hey, Faye, thank you and the crew for continuing to be in those conditions for us. We certainly do appreciate it. We're going to bring in Ginger now with the track and timing of the storm, as well as the heavy rain that's headed for the eastern part of the country. Right. So as disruptive as that's been, the snow there, it did really help. California went into February about half of where they should be for average. That's not great for reservoirs. Now they're at 104 percent of average in a month. They doubled everything. That's great as far as water goes. But speaking of water, we got a lot of it coming to the east coast and too much because a lot of us have had too much rain. Uh, New Orleans, part of this system that caused flash flooding there, will be making its way in rounds up the coast and so look for this both Wednesday then Thursday and the heavy rain all the way through the weekend and that's why some places will end up with two to five inches Michael Rhode Island for example Providence is about a half a foot above average for rain and way below for snow so it's going to be really wet yeah tough for everybody yeah. this weather I tell you thank you so much for that ginger